Hey, welcome back everyone. You have made it. So this is the last walkthrough of this AZ900 Azure examination series. My name is Sushant Sudish and I'm going to take you through this walkthrough to show you how to access and identify Azure preview services and features. So without wasting any more time, let's dive deep into it. In this task, we're going to review the marketplace preview features. Search the marketplace for preview, and then you can review any preview products that interest you. As you can see, it immediately displays all the preview marketplace solutions for us. So by going through this catalog, we can basically pick any preview feature and we can try it out. Let's find out how to try a preview feature within a Kubernetes service. So you can basically select a service within the marketplace. And once you are inside the service, you basically fill out all the details, but make sure you check out on the version tab. Within version, you can basically pick out the latest version or the oldest one. And most of the time, it includes a preview feature as well. These scenarios where new functionality or features are made available within an ex existing general available service, Although you may not be using Azure service in production, the preview feature or functionality may not yet be ready for a production deployment. You should be most aware of any limitations around the use of preview functionalities before deploying into a production environment. In this task, we will review the Azure updates page. Note the presence of the status is based on filters options named as now available, in preview, in development, etc. If you enable in preview checkbox, and then you would be able to basically filter those details based on the product or category you choose. When you filter these by containers, you would notice that the purge, you would notice that the page returns a list of items in preview related to Kubernetes and containers. Additionally, you can search by status called now available, or you can filter these by products which you want to find out in development as well. If you would like to change the category to different series like compute, now you are seeing all the list of product which is now available are now recently made available by Microsoft for compute series. So you get the whole idea, right? This is where you can use these filters to find out all the products which is in preview, in development and available. Congratulations. Now you know how to access the preview features within the portal and how to access the preview features from the Azure update portal as well. In the next video, we're going to go through the last module's review questions. Please go to the last review questions and test and validate for your examination.